We already know that Roidme F8 Vacuum Cleaner by Xiaomi is a great product, but how many reviews actually told you in which situation you shouldn't buy it? Before we jump on that subject, I would like to cover my initial feel about the device. First of all, package is great, everything is secured well and my first thought was if this had Apple name on it, I would be 100% sure that it is a real Apple product. Best description of Roidme F8 is this, it is a stick, metal stick, with motor and battery. Joke aside, everything goes around motor, battery and dust holder, this is one unit. Attachments are here to expand F8 usability. The concept is simple, but after first short usage I fell in love with F8. My apartment is around 40 square meters and I have a car, and for the first time in my life I enjoyed cleaning my house and car with vacuum cleaner. I would like to speak about accessories. In short, you get everything you would ever need. Default setup for cleaning your house floors and carpets, attachment is made of metal, and main head has motor which spins woven roller. This function is great in practice because when you use lower suction power, vacuum still manages to gather everything inside. You have two vacuum speeds, normal and max power. Normal speed can be adjusted through app in three stages, I recommend middle or high. Lowest one is really too low for my taste, but it has best battery autonomy. When you set up default suction power and when you start using your Roidme F8, you can choose a two suction levels, a default one and max suction power. There are two hardware buttons, one is on off and default speed, long press will turn on a max suction power and also you have a mode button which just shuffle a normal and max power speed. Philosophy is like this, with normal speed you can clean your house or apartment without any problem if you don't have carpets. If you have carpets then for fastest cleaning you will need to use max power which can last up to 12 minutes. This is the first thing which you should reconsider before you decide to buy F8. How big your house or apartment is and do you have a lot of carpets? If you have a lot of space to clean with carpets, then Redmi F8 isn't best solution for you if you want to clean your home in one run. If you don't want, then again F8 is a great option for you. Second thing which I didn't like is that there is no option to turn off roller motor, because if you are cleaning your floor just from dust, it is really just enough to pass without roller spinning, suction is more than enough to do all the work here. But these are just minor things which I wanted to point out. Let's speak about attachments. There is great attachment which I found absurdly good for cleaning my work desk from keyboard or anything other from which you want to remove dust. It works perfect. For tight places there is a neat attachment and for car, well, I will just say that this is your best friend for the car cleaning from now on and probably forever. I see in other reviews where people throw random things on floor and use F8 to clean it. You see a few examples in my review but I really think that there is no need to show something which is uh, common sense here. F8 is really strong vacuum cleaner with a lot of power on maximal power mode. If power is concerned for you then you shouldn't worry about it because there is a plenty of suction power in F8. There is only one thing which you need to ask yourself. How big is place which you plan to clean with F8? Is it important to do it in one run or multiple? And do you have a lot of carpets? My personal example is that for my 40 square meters apartment I need to use around half battery power for full detailing, clean and I have just two ultra small carpets. It is basically home without carpets to suction. In short time, Roidme F8 became my best friend, a life companion, an ultimate vacuum cleaner for my home. Here and now I would like to hear from you. What do you think about Roidme F8? Write down in the comments and until next video, cheers!